Make it, sing it, draw it, say it. This is how dog zombies play it. Do your monster furry creature. Draw a picture of my teacher. I like wafers, they're the best. Marcus Mel Drew's not impressed. Granny's custard's very lumpy. Delia is always grumpy. I'm so mixed. Show. Will I get invited to Indrani's party? Make your own pesky bug wrapping paper and doodle a lovely llama. Welcome to my brilliant show. Here you go, Amy. Here's an invite to my party. Thanks, Indrani. Florence, Marcus, Solid. I love llamas! Hi, I'm Tom, and this weekend is one of my favourites of the whole year. It's Indrani Hindu's party, and her parties are epic. Here's my top three favourites. At number three, the water park. Come on, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! Oh, Brad, you're so silly. Ha, <laughs> uh, uh -huh. Everyone had the best time. Careful, it's slippery. Number two, the bowling alley. Bowling shoes are the best. Go on, Tom, you can do it. <laughs> if you get the right size. Striker! Oh, my goodness. <laughs> ah. Oh, dear. Whoa, dude. It was still a strike, just not in my lane. Anyway, better than both of those parties is number one, the fair. Amazing. Indrani really enjoyed it. Until the end. Indrani's parties are always brilliant. I can't wait to find out what we're doing this year. We're going to farm a llama land. Where's your invite? It's okay. Indrani probably hasn't given them all out yet. Or maybe she didn't invite you. Yeah, of course she invited me. I hope. I think it's time to draw it. Hi, I'm going to show you how to draw a llama from Farmer Llama Land. It's Liz. She writes and draws all the Tom Gates books. You just need a piece of paper, a brush pen, pencil or anything else you want to draw with. Got it. Thanks, Liz. This is my version of a llama. It doesn't look exactly like a llama. Llamas have got kind of really long ears. Llamas have got lots of wool on the top of their head. Do the nose. The nose is almost like a little triangle. I'm going to have the tongue poking out too. I've got an eye on each side. I'm going to draw the eyelid going across. And they've kind of got quite long eyelashes as well. Llamas have got a very fluffy wool coat, a bit like a sheep. It's its tail. This llama, I'm going to have holding something. You'll see what in a minute. <laughs> so I'm going to add Tom into this drawing. Wow, now I am excited. Tom's a bit surprised. Right, now I'm going to show you what the llama's holding. It's an ice cream. <laughs> Great stuff. Let's add some colour. It's a nice sunny day. I'm just going to block in some yellow and then draw on top of it. I'm going to leave the llama white. I'm 
make a bit of orange. When I do the landscape, I'm just going to use a very, very light brush line. So you don't have to put much detail in. It's just showing the trees and a little bit of the hills in the background. Use a bit of green for the, for the bushes in Far Malama land. <laughs> Tiny bit of shading. Got my pink here. This colour's tongue and a little bit of ice cream around his face and the ice cream in too. Pencil there. So there you have it. There's a llama in Farmer Llama Land eating an ice cream. Love it. Johnny Hindle's party this weekend, and everyone is invited. Except me! Here she comes. Huh? Maybe she didn't see me. Bye, Tom. Oh. Yeah? <sighs> See you later. I haven't been invited. Do you want me to ask if you can come? Don't worry. I'll tell you all about it. It's fine. I can't go anyway. Why not? Because I'm going to... Chocolate World. Chocolate, Chocolate World? When are you going? Um, Saturday? All day. Oh no, you can't come to my party then. Um, no. But you didn't invite me, so... <sighs> He's been going on about it all day. <laughs> of course you're invited. I put the invite on your desk. <laughs> Oh. Oh, Tom. Shame you're going to Chocolate World. No! It's okay. I just remembered we're going to Chocolate World on Sunday. You said Saturday. No. Marcus is really annoying. But I don't care. I'm going to Indrani's party after all. Farm Alarma Land, here I come. Yay! It's time for Make It! How about giving a gift with your very own bug wrapping paper? You will need some plain paper, big enough to wrap your present, a pencil, scissors... Be careful with scissors! A pen, two small pieces of thick card, a sponge, some poster paint, and a paper plate. And a glue stick? No, sorry, not this time. Oh, all right. Bit awkward. Here we go. Got all that? Let's get making! Take one piece of card and draw a simple bug shape like this. Cut out the centre and make sure you leave the edges intact to make a stencil. Get a grown-up to help if you need to. Do the same for another bug. Make it a different size or shape. Put two small blobs of coloured paint on your plate. I'm using red and blue. Grab your sponge and cut it in half. Take your plain paper and get your paint and sponges ready. This is the fun bit. Place your stencil on the paper and carefully dab your sponge in the paint. Not too much. Then hold the stencil down and dab gently onto the paper like this. Lift your stencil up. It's the bug's body. Cover your paper with lots of bugs. And then repeat with the other stencil in a different colour. 
When the paint is dry, use your pens to add details to the bugs. Cute! Oh, great! Hooray! Wrap up your present, and if you like, you can finish it with some ribbon or string. Amazing! Try different patterns or stars, or even some ducks! Quack, quack! Welcome to my brilliant show! <laughs> Another brilliant Indrani Hindu party. <laughs> hey! <laughs> hey! 